you're on. Hi you guys, this is Gwendolyn and for today's video I would like to share with you a new Louis Vuitton handbag. Hi you guys, this is Alexis. I just wanted to jump in here really quickly and say this is a throwback video. Mom recorded it a little while ago and I just forgot to edit it. So I am editing it now and uploading it. All right, bye. That Lexi got to me. <laughs> it always was. You're on. Hi you guys. I'm First of all, we're experimenting and Hayden is filming today and I know it's been a little while so you may not remember who I am but <laughs> but I would like to share with you guys a handbag or a speedy that Lexi found for me at one of the her local thrift stores. Look at this you guys. This is like the this is a classic. So if there's something about the bag that, you know, you may notice is a little bit different than the other ones, like here's a Speedy 30. This is a 35, I believe. This is the one that she found. And I was looking up about the details and things like that in comparison to the 30 or the, I mean, a newer one. I don't know the exact year of this, but it is in pretty good condition. You know how... It is with the handbags, whereas the canvas isn't ripped or anything like that. I noticed the stitching is a little bit differently than a little bit different than some of these. The way the stitching is around the little what are these like pulls or something? I forgot what these are called. Anyway, it's a little bit different. But when I looked it up, I researched as much as I could about the handbag. That's the way a lot of them were made when they're really really classics. And so, but. She got this for a really good deal. I think this has been under... It was uh, $65. 65 bucks for this. And it's a 35. I love 35s and I, I still don't have my 40. I love the... It looks a bit larger. Like this is a 30, in my opinion. They look so tiny. Yeah, I do. Don't they look a little bit tinier to me? And I know a, a... What is it? A... The 25 we know is smaller, so cute. but they are cute. I love them, but I think I like the 35s are my favorites. And then I may eventually, like I said, get a 40. Mm -hmm. I don't know if Hayden needs to zoom in on something, whatever, so you can see a little bit better. But it's nothing in it right now. And, well, my stuff is... <laughs> I was scared. There's my stuff. I was looking for this. Okay, but... Oh, my coin. <laughs> I was looking for this stuff because I've been carrying it. Okay, and for this handbag, this Speedy, the 35, a classic, like I said, really, I'm thinking older, older, but it does say on here made in France or whatever, Spain or something like it that. It is France. Um, France, if I'm not mistaken. Made in France or something of the nature. Yeah, made in France. And this is something about that I can't zoom in that's well see but and inside of this one I love this but I don't know if Hayden can catch that I capture that it. it has no in um, the inner pockets it has no pockets at all and at first I was like okay where's the pockets and I found out some older older classics did not have that and they it was like you guys know the pretty much the history of Louis. I'm not an expert by any means, but you know they started doing little things throughout the years to, I guess, stop counterfeiting. So they started doing adding different things here and there randomly. So that's why some of the bags, when you go further back, may not look like the ones a few years, um, like more previous. I mean, more current. It right. may not look the same right. or whatever because they were they've been changing things up through the years, but. It seems authentic to me. Everything I can look up and check on it, the stitching, whilst they don't have a really record of the actual stitching, there is no, what is the thing that we've talked about, the little, the date step or whatever? Yeah, yes, there yeah. isn't one in here, I think. That was, all of these are things that are, were that way. The, it has a good zipper. It doesn't have on the, I cannot think of anything. The little, ah, the little rivets. It does not have Louis Vuitton on there. The logo is not on there. That's correct. 
everything I could think of, I looked up to see about this bag, and I'm telling you, everything I looked up seems to be on this, seems to be an authentic, authentic bag that she purchased for it, $65. Hmm. I don't care if it is or isn't, to be honest, because I'm just not, it doesn't matter to me that much, but it's cool to have one that seems to be really, really older. And the coloring here, that was, they were made out of nickel on the pull of the zipper. That's totally that way. It seems, I think it's authentic. I really do. I haven't had it checked out anything. Who cares for $65? But I then thought to myself, anyway, what's the likelihood of having a bag that much older? You know, and somebody mm -hmm. trying to copy everything I could think of about this bag is exactly what I read yeah. up on it. I mean, I wouldn't know, but I know that the thrift store does have other vintage bags there. They have vintage um, things, but like I said, it's everything they said about this fits this, the years back. You know, like I said, when they made the zipper pulls out of nickel at the time, they were this, all of these things. It wasn't that goldish color they started to use, and it was none of that at during this time. So it's nice. It is beautiful. The canvas feels really good and solid, just just like it feels better than this one. And this is a little bit older. I got this one pre-loved too. So this is considered pre-loved. And Lexi got this for me. It is amazing. A 35. I gotta send her back because I need <laughs> I need some other stuff. I need some Chanel's they and everything. Have, they had a Chanel or whatever they said in there. They had another Louis. I think they had two more. Um, but that one was the biggest. Oops. Not today. But Look at my cute little Isn't it cute little Minnie Mouse? Well, it's dirty, but isn't that cute? Because maybe it's fine tonight anyway. And back here, you guys, I have some tater tots and some, and some shrimp. That's how I mean, too. And I got it hidden behind my other little bag. Yeah, I got to eat. I got my eats on. So this is what I want to share with you guys today. I just want to come in and really say hi because it's been a minute. I've been really busy trying to get some things done. You guys know that Lexi... Well, I'm a really just a bookkeeper. She just uses me. She opened a <laughs> store and it's like, I'm going to put the... But it's, it's our store together. It's our store together, so she says. Wait till, the, wait till all wait till of the money started to roll in. <laughs> exactly, all of it. But you guys got to check out the store. And it's, what is in my shop? Wait, how, how do they it's find on, it? It's lexitflow.com. Lex, L-E-X, itflow.com. And we, I'll let her I'll put it in the description link. of every video that we're going to do because we just want you guys to come on there and, you know, look at some things, whatever. So, but so we'll put some of that in the description. I would, I don't know if you want to put the thrift store that you found this in on there. Oh, I can, I'll Because they it. have other. I got to look up the name for it, but I'll link it. It's I'll in her it. area in where she lives and everything. It's not too far in her area, but I'm going back out there to find some other things. This is. If you guys see it in person, it is really a beautiful bag. And I'm going to go to like a local, one of the cobblers, and let them clean it up for me. Like clean up the handles because it's just, even the leather is shiny on the handles. That's one of the things they did back then. They weren't, mm -hmm. they did the non-treatment of the leather after the vintage age. The, it's the shine. oh my gosh. It feels like the, what did I, Damia Bean or what, mm -hmm. how you pronounce it? Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah, see, um, what's that thingy like the little checkered pattern? pattern? Mm -hmm. I don't know how to pronounce it properly, but it feels like that. The handles and this telly is on. Look it up. <laughs> Girl got a good deal. But anyway, that's what I wanted to share with you guys today. I got some other things I want to catch up and get caught up with you guys. But I wanted to tell you about the store again, show you that. And I would do a video later showing you what all fits in 35 yeah, or what some people another that video. another, what did I say? Some, oh, you guys, I always do that in videos. I don't look like I'm having a seizure. I sort of got I'm not having a stroke or anything. Lexi has a song, one of her singles oh, yeah, that she put out. I had to say that. One of her singles. I forgot. It comes out next week. It comes out to next week. You guys, she, I told you guys I've been doing stuff. Look, I'm trying to tell you guys. You need some management. I'll <laughs> include a clip of it or something if you what want. What is the name of it again? The Pretty One. The Pretty One. It is amazing. So she has her song, Hayden Drums, in, and you guys know. So she has one of her singles, first single she's putting out, and she has others coming out. I'm telling you guys, tell me I've been working for real. <laughs> I've been doing stuff. In the background, rooting her on. 
But that's what I wanted to share with you guys, tell you about the song. I, I want her to put that in, in the description as well, please. So I'm going to add in anything. You guys know how I will. I'll throw a vacuum up here with some coffee. I don't care. Whatever <laughs> it takes to share with you guys. But glad to be back. And I'm going to try to keep it up a little bit more. I hope I'm in the, in the shot to it everything, guys. I mean, Hayden's filming. I'm, a great I'm just filmer. standing back here to supervise. Do okay. I, are you good, Hayden? Perhaps. You guys tell me if Hayden's good, if we need to fire Hayden, because I'm already thinking about firing Lexi. So, <laughs> you guys, but good, good to be back and everything, and I'm going to stay caught up on things as best that I can. But we are working on some things, and don't forget to check out the shop and check out our song. It's going to be in the description, and some other things I would like to talk to you guys about later. But, and there's all some things I want, I want to, ah! But I'm not going to put it all in this video. That's We've got just, some stuff that's we're just, working on. That's just wrong. That's ghetto. That's just going too far. <laughs> but you guys take care of yourself. Good being back. Remember to turn on the ding dingies. What, what, what? Notification notifications. Bell. Notifications. What else do I do? Um, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, yeah, that's <laughs> what you need to subscribe. Bye, Bye. You guys. I missed you. Bye. She's headed out the door Saturday night out with her friends Made plans she swore she wouldn't ignore This ain't her kind of scene And she's gonna go